it's time for another reaction okay we got an animation reaction to a story time okay but before i tell you the title and who it's by check out this intro man <laughs> All right, so look here, chat. We got a uh, we got ourselves an animation we reacted to. Um, this is "Getting Fake Jordans for Christmas" by Timeless Tim. Shout out Timeless Tim. Hey, YouTube. You too. You know what I'm saying? Thank you for the bits. Um, but y'all really fucked with the last Timeless Tim reaction. Y'all really liked it. So let's we gonna check out more Timeless Tim. Okay. Um, before we get into the video, make sure you're hitting the like button. Okay. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Turn on post notifications so you don't miss any future uploads. And after that, come over to the Twitch. Come vibe with us. We're chasing partnership over here. I would greatly appreciate you showing some love. You know what I'm saying? But with that being said, let's let's, let's check this video out. Let's see what Tom, what, 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 what Tim, Tim and Tim got going on. What was and crushed the shit out of him. Finish him. Then it was left. We're four seconds in, and there's a, a freaking a hello. Golly, four seconds into a nut punch. And crushed the shit out of him. Oh. Finish him. Then it was left. Yo, this man's intro is such a W, bro. This man's intro fire, is fire, such fire, a fire, W. Fire, fire, fire. Fu Gazy. Ooh. The worst world you could ever hear as a kid. But not for your boy. See, I grew up wearing fake everything. I rock fake sneakers, fake jewelry, fake clothes. Fam, it didn't matter what it was. If I got them on, please believe they're fake. Hey, listen, you fake it till you make it, chat. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Fake it till you make it. Listen, 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 listen. If you ain't got it like that, but you want to, hey, you know what I'm saying? Honestly, bro, let me be honest with y'all. There's some, there, there was a couple of replicator companies that hit me up. I was like, nah, because I just don't want to, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to have this type of energy. But listen, there's some replicating companies that make fake Jordans sometimes, and they're fucking, they're, they're, their material be better than the material on the Jordans. You know what I'm saying? Like, replicate, replicate, rep, rep, replica something. That's I don't me know. not going to lie, sleepy. Listen, like, that shit is crazy. Like some of the patent leather, cause um my homie does sneak he does he's a sneaker YouTuber. So he had to do the difference between real Jordans and fake Jordans. And like literally he was like, yo, the fucked up thing is the leather on this shit feels better than the leather on the real Jordan. You know what I'm saying? It's how how, how the replicators making better feeling fucking, you know what I'm saying? That shit is crazy, bro. Like back in the day you used to really be able to tell Jordans were fake, but now Bro, they making better Jordans than the goddamn <laughs> Jordan company. But I feel you. Damn, Tim. You supposed to be that kid. I uh, sure was that kid with the bro fit. But you know what? It wasn't a big deal to me. See, my parents were smart and they provided me with all the essentials of life. I had food on the table, roof over my head, clothes mm -hmm. on my back, even though they were fake as hell. <laughs> but times have changed. Nowadays, everybody's exposing each other for rocking fake jewelry on social media. That's right. Problem is, too many people are too concerned with what others think about them. They're about that... spending money they don't have on. On oh, God, stop! Listen, I had to. I learned that the hard way. You know what I'm saying? I was. Al I was always spending more than I was making. And that is not a way to live, Chad. I'm going. I'm telling you that pay the paycheck, the paycheck. You know what I'm saying? Trying to buy this and that when you already got the essentials and you can save money, bro. Bro, listen, it's not. I'm telling you, it's not the wave. If you can't afford to buy, listen. If you can't afford to buy it twice, you shouldn't be buying it. Jay Z said it. Jay Z said it best, bro. If you can't pay, you you can't buy it twice. You don't need to be buying it, bro. On things they don't need. Now for this story, I'ma take you back, back to my preteen years. Now as usual, each Christmas my parents would ask me what I wanted for a gift. Now for this Christmas, hoo -hoo, I knew 
this was that Christmas. See, I expected a good gift. My grades were solid, and guess what, my guys? I didn't fake them this time, and I hadn't gotten in trouble all year long. Okay, So okay. I went for that bag. I asked my parents for the OG Chicago Red Air Jordan 1s. Now, for those of you who don't know, the ones, whoo, the cream dollar cream of all sneakers. Thanks. Oh, you got the LeBrons? Okay, that's cool. You got the Kobe's? Okay. But if you bought that sneaker life, mm -hmm. you got to have the ones. But here's the thing. See, I, I wanted the original merch. Jordan ones, the retros, my guy. See, the ones came out in 1985, all for $65. But that's years before I was born. So please believe, by the time I wanted them, they gonna cost that bag. Mm -hmm. Now, just in case you don't believe me, check out the price tag Golly. on the OGs right now. Going for 35 Gs, my God. God. <laughs> yo, 30, yo, if I, yo, chat, I don't care how much, my, bro, I don't care if I make this much in one day. I will never spend this much money on some fucking shoes. I there's out there's motherfuckers out here that make this much money in one day. If I ever was to even make this much money in one day, I would not spend it on no fucking on no shoes. Yo, you got crazy, bro. Crazy, bro. I don't care if I made that much. Well, maybe if I made that much a minute. You know what I'm saying? If you made $34,000 a minute, then maybe. You know what I'm saying? Because in the whole day, I didn't make... You know what I'm saying? So maybe. But like, um, that much a day? You want me to... No, bro. No, bro. I would. I, I, don't, I think I'm going to set a limit to myself. Even when... if, if Even if I ever do hit like a, a, a certain staple where I'm making like good money, I don't think I'm ever spending... Facts, Jay. You said the best. I don't even think I'm gonna, I'm gonna ever spend over a thousand dollars for a pair of shoes. I just don't feel like I will have that in me, because that's like, it's like, bro, like, bro, like, if I walk on this ground, they, if I do use these shoes for their intended purpose, if I use these shoes for the inside, yeah, they're OGs. I understand they're that. They're OGs though. You know what I'm saying? I understand that, but it's still like, uh, you know what I'm saying? But like, I, I don't think I would ever spend even like I, I right now I'm not I'm not spending a thousand dollars on no fucking shoes. You got me fucked up. But even if I was making a uh, ass of money, I still don't think I'd spend over a thousand dollars on shoes. Just for the simple fact that if I wear them and do what they're intended to do, they're going to get dirty. They're going to get fucked up. And I spent thirty a thousand dollars on something when I can't make the money back from them. Now, say I get paid for, like, posting Instagram pictures or something, and I can make my money back by taking a picture, like, with a fit in that shoe, then maybe I can make my money back, you know what I'm saying? But I'm not spending uh, over $1,000. That's a liability, you know what I'm saying? Never. Never, bro. Never, bro. How much is an ass of money? Probably, like, you know what I'm saying? I know, I know, I know some people that make, like, like fifty to sixty thousand dollars a month. Good point. You know what I'm saying? So like fifty to sixty thousand dollars a month, maybe even seventy. I know I know I know somebody that make fifty. But like if I make you know what I'm saying? Then maybe. But like, bruh. Bruh, nah, bruh. Nah, bruh. I'm not paying listen, I don't ever pay like if a shoe costs two twenty and they trying to charge me like five hundred, you got me fucked up. The most I will ever pay for a resale shoe, you know what I'm saying? And I know the retail price was like maybe 170 and you're trying to retail it for, to me for 400 No. I will maybe, maybe give you $100 over what you paid. Maybe. If I really want the shoe, I'll give you over $100. But other than that, you're going up only, you going up over $100 of what the shoe came on, bro. No. No, bro. Ooh. No, but just like usual, no. my parents promised they'll do what they can to cut These resellers is crazy. So fast forward to Christmas Eve, and it was finally that time to open my gift. So I get to my gift, open, and there it was. Brand new Air Jordan. Jump, man, serve him. Oh, <laughs> hell no. This ain't it. No. Now, just in case you oh don't know, God. the jump, man, serve him. Mm, that's what you bought if you couldn't afford the real Jordans. And I already know. Damn. 
tip. I've never heard of these shoes. Exactly. <laughs> what the hell did moms get me? It's fake ass Jordans. Now, in case you're new to the channel, I've been here before and I knew this was a test. I sure as hell wasn't going to be ungrateful again. Oh, hell no. I still have flashbacks from that ass whooping. Mm -mm. You heard of Man of Steel, right? Well, my guy, I got ass of steel from all the ass whoopings I've gotten in my life. So I looked deep in my mom's oh my eyes God. and said, Mom, Them shit is these shoes, they suck. Ha, <laughs> boy, you crazy? I said, thank you. These are the greatest. Oh, while well, I knew these were. See, you can't say they're the greatest, but you you can say thank you. I appreciate it. But I wouldn't then say they're the greatest because then your mom would probably be like, oh, well, then I don't need to buy him the shoes since he thinks those are so great. You know what I'm saying? But I'd just be like, thank you, Ma. I appreciate you for buying me this. But I'm like, I'm not going to say these was the greatest or these was the ones I want. Because what if she feel in her mind? Oh, well, then I don't need to. Hey, uh, you know what I'm saying? I'm showing my gratitude. Go ahead. Run me that. You know what I'm saying? That, that, that real, that real, the real shoes. You know what I'm saying? Run me that. You know? The most garbage shoes of my life. Now you see that? That's what you're supposed to do. Even though I wanted to throw them garbage ass kicks in the trash. <laughs> but in life, you're supposed to be grateful for the gifts you receive. Facts. Even though there's some broke ass Jordans. I mean, come on guys. It was either the Jumpman Servum or the Shaq Walmart sneakers. Oh my so, God. I'm rocking the mics, my guy. So the next day I get up early, put on my brand new crispy Jordans and rocked them to the park. Now here comes the problem. See, in my oh. neighborhood, if you wore Jordans, woohoo, damn, you wore them at your own risk. You might they as well be walking outside em. with a red dot on your Boom. head because you were walking Target. So I get to the park and from everyone's reaction, I knew I was finally that kid. Damn, tell me I see you, okay? You rocking them J's? So as usual, if someone's already playing, you pick the next team and start getting ready to hoop. So I'm sitting there playing my Game Boy, patiently waiting for my chance to hoop on my new J's. But then I he said, said, "I'm not wearing okay, them bitches." What size of shoes you wear? Oh. Now, when a person asks you what size of shoe you wearing, mm, 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 please believe. Damn, they trying to they trying to get the surfums. Golly, them ain't even like the them ain't even like OG, bro. Them shits is not no ones, no twos. No threes, no fours, no f Them shits ain't even 18s, my nigga. Them shit. <laughs> them shits ain't even 18s, chat. These is surf them. These is, these is team shoes, bruh. Bruh. These is team shoes. It's about to go down. You about to get jacked for your sneakers. God, I already knew it. Okay, Tim. Not today. If you get jacked for your sneakers, mom's gonna kill you. So I look up. And these three dudes standing right in front of me. Look hey, just, what we got here, boys. Just Ooh, hit the burners, bro. Somebody's got some fresh J's. I said, little man, what size are those? Oh, shh. Okay, Tim. It's three of these fools. Tears of joy, 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 tears of joy. like a straight up bitch. Or stand here joy. and fight. Now, my guy, I'm gonna ask you. I'm not one fighting. I'm more hitting the burners. Time. What? I said, I'm not fighting three dudes over no servums. Not over no team shoes. I'm not fighting you over no team shoes. But I'm not about to get my mom beat my my ass beat by my mom either. So I'm hitting the goddamn dash. Dude, see, this was it. First thing first, I'm younger and smaller, which meant I was weaker and probably slower. Second thing. I was solo, meaning I'll have to knock each dude out and then dip. So I start preparing for my next move. And just like I always say, you never give the opponent the chance to have the first move. You, my guy, must have the element of Oh surprise. my god. So as I'm leaning like I'm about to take my shoes off, I grab one of the dudes right by the balls and crush the shit out of him. Finish oh. him. Then it was on the left. <laughs> so the second guy rushes towards me and I went straight for the low kick right on the dude's nuts. Oh, I'm playing dirty. I'm going to win by... <laughs> Yo! <laughs> this nigga... Oh, my God, bro. This nigga is nut-punching all... <laughs> 
Ruin all their chances for kids for real. So low kids, right? All the bitch. Oh, I'm playing dirty. I'ma win Bruh. by any means necessary. Now I've got one more nut to crush, and I know this nigga said this nut to it. crush. So I'll wait for the right opportunity to go for my signature nut crushing kick. So I go for the kick. <laughs> Damn, this wasn't gonna work again. Uh uh, because my man's already seen my secret weapon. So he blocks my kick and goes for my nut. Oh. Oh no, my man's still in my trick. But since I was shorter, I had the advantage. And so I stepped back and my man's missed. But by now, the other two had recovered from the nut crush. Oh, but damn. Bam, that's all I had. I didn't know how to fight as a kid. I was sure as hell wasn't going to fight three bigger guys. Oh no. Oh, but hell no. I'm no punk either. So I looked deep in their eyes. And I knew they going to f*** me up. So I dipped red for my <laughs> life and never went back to that park again. So... Moral of the story. Bruh. Happiness isn't about getting what you want all the my time. My man did the dash. She should have did that from the beginning, my boy. Being grateful for it. Oh my god. What's up, world? Thank you for joining <laughs> your boy for another. <laughs> my man did the dash. Listen, I'm a runner. I'm a track star. I swear. Listen, listen. Cause no. Cause listen. Cause listen. No. You know what I'm saying? Like, what I look like. But. That was a W video, you know what I'm saying? How y'all feel about the chat? How, how y'all feel, chat? W video? W vid? I, I think it was a W vid, you know what I'm saying? But look, y'all say bye to YouTube, okay? Uh, listen, YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't, and turn on notifications. Please, 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 please. And then after that, come over to Twitch. Come vibe with us. Come chill with us. We are trying to touch 100K on YouTube, and then we're trying to reach partnership on Twitch. So that'll help, you know what I'm saying, tremendously if you do both of those things that popped up on the screen. But we out, man. Me and Twitch, we're going to go react to another video. Y'all go watch another video. And with that being said, you have yourselves a good one. Man. Big pieces.